Hey, welcome to Jitex. This is Dubai, where else the largest technology and the startup show could be on this planet. So this is this year it's got even larger. It's taking the entire city, including Dubai World Trade Center and the Dubai Harbor. So it's spread over 41 pavilions. That's absolutely whooping size. And uh, of course, Xbot is here. So, but to find it, we have to travel a lot of pavilions. And while we're walking, let me just show you what was the best things that we could find here in the Jitex Dubai in 2023. I think it's gonna be super cool, keep watching. Let's walk and see what we can find over here. Let's go. Look at this, absolutely out of this world. This place is amazing, the technologies. Look at this car, it blows my mind. There's so much technologies here. Let's check out what they have here. Self-driven vehicle that takes you from point A to point B that you are basically dialing in and it just brings you so you don't have to drive it. And this is like a small bus or something that can be used in the micro cities, that can be used in the bigger cities. So it's pretty cool and it has huge screen and huge windows from inside that, uh, that you can see how, how the whole drive is happening. So cool. Let's see what that thing is. Autonomous bus, which is already functioning in the Yas Island in Abu Dhabi. So this is not a thing of tomorrow, that is a thing of yesterday because they already installed it. So it's already working on the test rounds in the Yas Island and Abu Dhabi. So it's super cool, no driver just takes from one destination to another. Great. I think it's ready to box. You've seen dogs jumping and flipping. This guy is looking like boxing. Intelligent mobility. And this is something new for your home. It's the tiles that can become your floor, your bed, your tea table, pretty much anything. So they can go vertical and turn into seats. Your living room can be flat out, and then the next point at the bottom, it, it turns into the dining, dining room. And the next point at the bottom, it turns into a living space or sleeping space like a bedroom. Mercedes is showing with a concept. It's a, probably the best, the, the best place where you can show your concept cars and the concept of the future. Definitely Jitex. Advertising cube. It shows the advertising in 3D almost like, looks like it's inside. The cards. So the entire card is intelligent. So when we put things in, it's going to recognize what we are putting in. And we can check out right from, from here. So we can just tap with a credit card and go. So the card is a checkout station. That's cool. Let's see whether it recognizes this, this way. Uh, it has to be upright, yeah? Okay, it's grapes. Okay. Now it is bell pepper. And now it is grapes, banana. <laughs> Ah, it's showing us all the options so we can select what it is. Okay, what happens to a carrot? You have to keep it upright. Keep your carrot upright. Okay, and you got the price for your carrot. So, 25 cents. Good, thank you. So, but they, they need to work probably on the different variations of it. So, is this still a carrot? Not a carrot anymore. It's already in the car for so if few items probably it's easier to recognize, right? So it's only one, it's that's the that's the top part, thanks. New robots for the storage. Oh, so it's self-picking, storing items, changing places. And this is a soft grip. On the X bot, we have a hot grip. So if it grips too hard, it will break the cup. And that's one of the soft grips, that's uh, that's something of a new age. It can pick figs without spoiling or squishing them and they are all different in size so it is able to sense and 
give it a certain pressure. So these grips are a super cool thing of a new of the new age because they are able to, to sense it. So it hasn't broken any fix yet. I want to go for lunch. Ah, there is something with the AI. Nice shop technologies. Look at this AI camera. It recognizes that I'm seeing whether it will mix genders or not. <laughs> So it does recognize that I'm a guy, and let's see my age. Middle, I'm the middle age yet still. Great, great. So and then it has all the states of what, uh, what, what how, how long was my attention uh, to a certain place, and what is the, the things that probably fit me, and then it sees the other people in the shop, can see their attention span, and can give a lot of data to the shop, uh, to the shop owners to understand which stuff to keep in the store, like for which age are you, uh, are you keeping your items and what is the audience that's coming in into the store. So that's a super cool thing to analyze it. Sustainable food. I just found out that usually about 60% of the mango production doesn't even leave the farm. So the minimum is 40%. That's a whooping number. So a lot of food is actually getting wasted. So here what, uh, what they focus on is uh, to freeze dry it and then it can be turned into powder, it can be turned into chips and stuff like that. And then uh, there are even 3D printers for the powdered version. So they have this molecular food which will freeze dry it and it can be tried as a, as a powder. So and then it was printed on the 3D printer. So the 3D printer is pretty good for the restaurants actually because they can print practically anything. They can print Burj Khalifa made of food. Right, so that's super cool technologies uniting one after another. Let me try that. Tastes like mash. Six thousand participants, forty-one pavilions, two mega venues, Giant Twenty Twenty Three, and guess who is the best of all of that? Of course, my own creation. That is the Xbot. Let's go and see what we have here. So we are having coffee station and the ice cream station over here. So this uh, is a medium spec of the Xbot over here. So it uh, does not have the food, it does not have the tea. So it comes with a full range of coffee and a full range of the ice cream. So and let's see how much it's done so far. We have in the application how many it's served in a day today. This is one of the least populated pavilions, it's pavilion 24, so it's like deep, deep inside. It has done 57 servings till 3 p.m., so it's not bad. We are, do we are talking about 60, 70 cups from 57 servings. So get in touch with us, see what we can do for your business, see how you can bring this into your local airport, your local park, uh, your local waterfronts. These are the best locations to squeeze the maximum ROI from the, uh, from the Xbox. Get in touch with us for the full specs. Bye.